Today we're gonna ins properly install some Deutsch connectors in the harness here in this fan for the oil cooler on this 818 that we built custom for a customer. Here we have all the pieces we need to get the male connector and the female connector, the crimping tool, the uh, wedge lock install tool, and the s strippers. First we're going to strip this to the proper length before you put the socket in. And this is an 18 gauge. Now we've stripped it to the proper length. In order to know what the proper length is, you insert the wire into the terminal and you can see the wire through the hole here. And you don't want it to be too short so you can see a little bit of wire exposed in the bottom. That way you know for sure that the insulation is not hitting the socket. So here we could use the DMC crimping tool, but today I will be using the Pro's Kit crimping tool for the DT connector. All you do is slide it into the socket and you crimp it as hard as you can, you let go, and it's perfectly crimped on the bottom. And now we'll crimp this socket with the DMC crimping tool. Just set the set the sock set the tool the way you'd want it to be. This is a 16 contact and a 20 and an 18 gauge wire. Slide in the tool, crimp down, and you can see the difference between the two tools, but they're both crimped properly. Two. Now we'll insert it into the female connector. We'll do black in two, red in one. There are proper insert tools for these as well, but I'd like to just show you how easy it is to insert the wires without the special tool. And now we'll install the wedge lock. With the wedge lock in place, there's no way for the wires to come out. And now we just connect the two sides. You can hear the click and you're good to go. Now we'll show you how to take the wires out of the male side and the female side. For the male side, take the tool Remove the wedge lock. There's a tab on the inside of this connector. Lift the tab up. And pull the wire out. And on the female side, use the hook side of the tool. Pop the wedge lock out. Move the locking tab. Pull the wire out. So now all that's done, I'll show you the two tools that we use for crimping. This is a DMC AF8 tool, and this is with the Tourette. So this does three different contacts. You could do a size 12 contact, size 16, size 20 that does from anywhere from a 12 gauge to a 26 gauge wire these ones are pretty expensive they're roughly about $400 uh, and you'd want to use this if you're building like a professional harness or you know your shop like us where we do a lot of wiring harnesses and a lot of wiring for a whole bunch of different vehicles or you go to amazon.ca and 
pick up one of these cheaper versions. Uh, and these are specific for the DT or the DTP connectors, uh, which are the much larger than the DTM, which are the much smaller sized co contact size 20. You can go on our link on amazon.ca and pick up these for roughly about 40 bucks. Thanks for watching and comment below if you have any questions for us about this or any future products or future projects you want to see and like and subscribe for future episodes.